do something for us. Uh, verse 25 in that Galatians. Mm-hmm. Yeah, we back here at Galatians chapter 3, verse... Um, was that? 23. Yeah, 23. Yeah. It says, but before faith came, we were kept under the law, shut up to the faith, which was, which should afterward be revealed. Wherefore, the law was our schoolmaster to bring us onto Yahweh Shine, that we might be justified by faith. Right. Justified by faith, man, you know? Because it's all about your belief, man, you know? Like I quoted earlier, Yahweh Shai is coming back. That's what he's looking for, man. You know, he's looking for that faith, man. You know, mm-hmm. who's still going to have it, you know? Because mm-hmm. it's going to be all type of turmoils and, you know what I'm saying, hell, that's going to happen, man. You know, that's going to sway a lot of people. <laughs> yeah, faith, it's, man. It's, yeah, it's you know? cool now. I, and the thing is, when, I, when we say that, it's like even concerning ourselves, like, man, we just hope and pray the Lord don't break us, man. Right, right. You know what I'm saying? Because it's going to get so crazy out here. It ain't going to be cool to just be, to have the faith, man. Mm-hmm. All right? And the history shows you that with the Christian persecutions that took place in the Roman Empire. Yeah. And it wasn't just one. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? It was, it was, it was, it, it, it had happened. And then, hey, it, it may be 50 years that went by and it happened again. It happened again. The persecution of Nero. The persecution of Diocletian. You know what I'm saying? It was different emperors that implemented the persecution of those who believed in Yahweh. That's right, man. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. What you think this time is different? Mm-hmm. That's why, you know, we encourage brethren to truly build your faith in this thing. Right, man. Truly believe, like literally lean on the Lord. Like that's all we that's what I'm doing. So I'm telling you exactly what I'm doing. That's right. So when that shit happened and that shit scary as hell, your flesh. It's telling you, man, you better quit playing and, and and bow the head or you finna die. Yeah. You finna hurt. You finna get through some pain. When that shit start coming in and it's in the most intense form, man, I'm hoping that, and we should all be hoping that you have our smell shot going to do something for us. You know what I'm saying? That's right, man. Yeah. But a lot of people going to fold, mm-hmm. you know, because mm-hmm. we know Esau. He going, he going, just like the scripture say, it's going to be, do this, you know, as far as, you know, get this MOTB, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Or die. You that's know? it. Whoever ain't going to take it, you just going to, you know, you're going to die, you know? Yeah. And that's going to be the decree. You know what mm-hmm. I'm saying? And it's going to be like, hey, what you going to choose? What you going to do? You know? And we, we hope to be on the side of the Lord, man, it's, and staying on this side. Yeah. Man. Miracles, we hoping for the Lord to just... Give us the, the the will to not bow the knee, period. Mm-hmm. I didn't, you know, you've been through, all of us been through certain things in life where it was pain, painful as hell. You maybe thought how you was going to get through it and all of that. But this one, this one is going to top every single last experience. That's, that's how I see in it. Oh, yeah. This one going to top. And I didn't been through some shit before. Mm-hmm. All of us, have, I've been through some shit before, you know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. But, uh... I can't see like anything I've experienced that's gonna really top that moment of, of of really being challenged in your mind to do good or evil. Yeah, bro. This you is, know, it's the final. <laughs> <laughs> Our final. temptation. You know Fight. Final. <laughs> final. <Proud. laughs> <laughs> 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 I'm telling my son, dear God, <laughs> dear God. <laughs> Dear God. <laughs> oh man. Psalms chapter one forty six. Verse 6, he made heaven and earth, the sea and everything in them. He keeps every promise forever. He gives justice to the oppressed and food for the hungry. The Lord frees the prisoners. We must remember this. He keeps every promise. Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai keeps every promise.
Revelation chapter 3. I'm sorry, Revelation chapter 2, verse 10. Don't be afraid of what you are about to suffer. The devil will throw some of you into prison to test you. You will suffer for 10 days. It could actually be 14 days or a month. Or it could only be four days. You don't know. But if you remain faithful, even when facing death, I will give you the crown of life. The word to suffer means in a bad sense, to suffer sadly, be in a bad plight. Because this, according to Daniel's 12, is unlike a time that was never, let me grab it, the time of the end. Daniel's 12 and 1, at that time, Michael, the archangel, who stands guard over your nation, will arise. Then there will be a time for, there will be a time of anguish greater than any since nation first came into existence. But at that time, every one of your people whose name is written in the book will be rescued. All right. That's why it's about hoping. In the mercies of the Lord, which the elect will do. Those that are written in the book. Revelation chapter 3 verse 10. Because you have obeyed my command to persevere. I will protect you from the great time of testing that will come upon the whole world. To test those who belong to this world. Okay. And he's going to protect us. How? By... Feeding us this word, feeding us the stories written a fourth time. All right, through us reading daily, doing our lessons daily, it's a sense of uh, downloading this into our memories. All right, may the Lord bring it forth in a time of great danger. All right, that's pretty much it. This is meant to be a quick hit. You know, just uh, wanted to play a beautiful point that out the brothers made. You know, and with that, I want to give all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Ba'ashem Yahweh Shai, Ba'ashem Rakakwadash, Yahweh is who the world ignorantly calls God, Yahweh Shai is his son, who the world ignorantly calls Jesus Christ. Double honor to the elder apostles and elder bishops of Great Millstone for being faithful witnesses to the Holy Spirit, and Shalom to the elect. Shalom.